This is not the end. This is simply a transition. Big changes could be coming. It's day five of the Diocese of Buffalo holding a Southern Tier West Vicariate meeting at the Blessed Mary Angela Parish in Dunkirk. I caught up with Father Brian Zelineski of the Diocese. He tells me Tuesday's meeting was the same as previous meetings with parishioners hearing what could lie ahead for their churches. Now here's a breakdown of those recommendations. St. Anthony and and St. Joseph and Fredonia both would merge with Holy Trinity, as well as St. Elizabeth and Seton and Blessed Mary Angela in Dunkirk. We have to be relevant for the future, and we have to make sure that the resources that we have are being put in the right spots. Maintaining empty buildings is not where we need to spend our resources and our time, but on people. So why is this all happening? It is happening because of cultural trends, because of people, uh, you know, their expression of spirituality and faith is much different than it used to be. The generations are not practicing their faith like they used to. So all of those contribute to uh, the, re the recommendations that we're making today. And what will happen to the priests of the parishes that may be closing? They're still going to be ministering in our parish communities. The ones that are going to be remaining will have the priests to continue masses and to continue ministering to the people. They won't be having to administer all the physical locations. That takes up a lot of their time, energy, and resources. Will be able to be focused on fewer locations? but focused on the ministry of the people. The diocese says all parish families will be able to present their proposals from July 15th to August 23rd. The diocese will then review those proposals. An official list of recommendations will be released by September 1st. We need to pray together to continue to move forward in hope. We are a people that have hope. Jocelyn Person, 7 News Dunkirk.